The active condenser in the Republic of Kazakhstan has been destroyed and the rift is now inaccessible. We are now the only nation with access to the infoworld. This situation opens up new strategic and military perspectives. Now we're going to launch new programs to discover possible energy resources and develop military applications. We've already found ways of linking entities to human soldiers, and this is just the beginning. Now, this is more important than the race to space for developing nuclear capability. We have discovered a new world. A world for us to conquer. This is the beginning of a new era for our nation. Pentagon top brass getting you down? McGrath makes me sick. Just a typical cynical asshole. You know, I would be doing the country a favor if I let Aiden take care of him. Yeah, we played our part in all of this. Well, we did the right thing. I don't think humanity needs a third world war. What are you gonna do now? Maybe I'll go back to the people I like. And the people who like me for who I truly am. I haven't met too many along the way. <sighs> and what about you? The CIA has it all mapped out for me. Top tier, big car, golf meetings. I, mean, I haven't given him an answer yet, but it's worth considering. Listen, Jody, I, I know it's been complicated between us, and I, and I didn't always do the right thing. But maybe we could start again. You know, try and build something together. I mean, after. All the stuff we've been through, maybe we could make it work. What about Aiden? I'll get used to him. And I'm sure he'll end up getting used to me. I mean, we, we have something in common. We both care about you. It's worth a try. <laughs> Nathan's looking for you. Come on, I'll take you to his office. Later, Ryan. Oh, you know what? I got a single malt in my office that needs sharing. Meet you in a few? Never say no to a single malt. <laughs> Great, I'll see you in a bit. Let's go, Jody, Nathan's waiting.
All right, here we are. Call me when you're done, I'll come pick you up. Whatever Nathan says, be careful. Come in. Jody, oh, I'm so glad to see you safe. I kept my part of the bargain. Now it's the CIA's turn. As far as the CIA is concerned, you no longer exist. Elizabeth North. No identity and no life. Five hundred thousand dollars. For services rendered. That should help make a new start. Thanks. Before you go, there's one last thing I'd like to ask. When my wife and daughter disappeared in that accident 15 years ago, I wanted to die too. I cried a lot, hanging my head against the wall trying to figure out why, why, why them. Never being able to hold them again. It was like a wound that wouldn't heal. But then you came along. And I realized they were still here all the time, near me. I just couldn't see. gave me everything I needed to study the infraworld. They were interested in military applications. I was interested in seeing my family again. It's taken me some years, but I finally succeeded in creating this. Hello, my darlings. Condenser that can communicate with the souls of the infraworld. Speaking with the dead Jody, can you imagine? What do you want from me? I want you to help me talk to them. I want to hear their voices. I want to tell them what I'm doing. Until I finish my research, you're the only one that can do it. Give me your hands. 